a lot of circumstances that are causing you a lot of anxiety and you just don't feel peace, I want to share with you something practical that you can do that I have found in the book that I'm following. It's called Busyness, Finding God in the Whirlwind by Juanita Ryan. And today's focus was on uh, Philippians 4, 6 through 9. Or it's actually Philippians 4, 4 through 9. And um, if you don't know what is written there, then I, I highly recommend that you go to the Bible and you look it up um, and really focus on that and see what it is that, um, what are the instructions that He's giving us to live peacefully, to not be anxious. Uh, but I want right now I just want to focus on something practical that you can do, which is found at the end of that study. So it says, in a moment of quiet, write a list of things that are causing you anxiety, and another list that you are needing and wanting in relationship to these anxieties. Talk to God about these concerns as you thank God for God's love and care. Take a few minutes to write a gratitude list, thanking God for gifts big and small, ordinary and extraordinary. For a moment, breathe in peace, calm, hope, and joy that can flow from the practice of noticing and expressing gratitude for God's good gifts and loving activity in your life and in this world. And if you have essential oils, please take one, like peace and calming, or joy, or hope, and just put put a drop in your hand and just anoint yourself with it, like behind your ears, on your chest. Just inhale the the um, the aroma and help. So because these oils, these aroma can help us just stay focused and just really feel that gratitude and really start breathing in truly breathing in peace and calm and hope and joy. And then think, how might this practice change your experience in the midst of your business, of the busyness of your life? So let's take a moment to pray real quick. Dear Lord, we thank you that in the midst of the busyness of our lives, in the midst of the whirlwind of everything that's happening around us, we can come to you and we can be grateful that you are with us. Our circumstances may not be ideal. People may have betrayed us, rejected us. There may be things in our life that are just beyond our control, that are just causing so much chaos. Help us to stop focusing on these things and just bring our focus back to you. Back to your presence. Because in your presence we can experience so much love and joy and peace. Help us to keep our focus on you and be grateful that you are present with us in every single circumstance. Help us to not look down at the storm of life, but look into your eyes and just allow you to fill us with the peace that surpasses all understanding, a peace that we can't find in this world from anyone or anything, but only from you. We pray it in Jesus' precious name. Amen. So go in peace and stay grateful knowing that God is with you in the midst of all your anxieties.